So this is my new lead, the Nolan N72X. So I've just bought this, my first adventure helmet. I've bought it in the colors to match the bike, red, black and white. It's got the peak on the front. Exhaust vents at the back. And what else have we got? Right, so it comes with a large visor. The pin lock is included, and that's actually fitted to the helmet when you purchase it. I like that the visor comes all the way up and the visor is kind of protected by the peak. So at least it's not going to get scratched when I'm handling the helmet. It's got a sun visor, this little catch here. Comes down in different increments. There's the sun visor. And then to release it, you just press this button under here. The visor, sorry, the peak can come off. You just undo that screw, undo that one, and the peak can come off. I've got Mikado fitted. And another feature we've got is this little ring, you can take it off. But when you've got the helmet on, if you pull these, these little tabs, each side, it pulls this close into your neck. So it puts down on wind noise inside the helmet. It's got a little cut out here you can remove. And the same here on the back. And I believe that's for the Nolan, their intercom system. I think it fits inside the helmet. And one of the big features, what attracted me to this helmet was the chin piece. And the bit I liked, just, just, just that, is at the moment, I've just got this GoPro on there for temporary. Because the camera, what goes there is I'm actually recording with it. So I've got my USB-C, which comes out here. And I've just plugged that into my power bank in my tank bag or in my pocket. And I've got my me, me mic lead. So inside the helmet, right there is my Cardo mic. And the orange one is the camera mic. So what you do is I unplug my USB here unplug my mic here and then these two silver tabs press them in and the chin part comes off so what I've got now is I've got the chin part separate and then you can have it as an open face helmet so there's my microphones I've just cable tied them both together so that's now an open face helmet. It also comes with two little blanking plates you can put in there to cover that up. So here we go, there's the chin part. It comes with a chin curtain. So what I've done, I've got this little mic adapter there and my USB-C. So what I can do now, I can keep my camera on the chin mount got power supply it will have a bike and what I can do is if I put up somewhere for a quick drink all I need to do is pull my USB out here pull the mic out and I can take off the chin mount and that way I can leave the helmet on it saves me having to take the helmet off take my neck buff off all that so I can just remove the chin guard and plus once the camera's on there 
and my USB's plugged in and my mic's plugged in, I never really need to remove the camera. So all I need to do is, whenever I get back from a ride, take my chin piece off, put the helmet away, and then if I just plug a USB into there, into my computer, I can transfer the footage. I can also charge the camera while it's on there. So the camera will never need to come off. So I can just leave it mounted permanently. The only time I'd ever need to get the camera off is if I had to remove the battery or the memory card. But at least that way I can quickly unplug the front of it. If I'm stopping somewhere, get something to eat or something to drink. And all I do, get back on the on the bike and then just push it back in. And all you do to push it back in, you just line up these. And it'll snap into place. So on this side, line it up. It snaps into place. And there we go. I tried the Albitech yesterday on the bike and it was, it was lovely. The peak is perfect. It works brilliant in that low sun. So I'm well happy with that. I've got the Almid Farm Helmet City. It was £299 and there was a discount on over Christmas. There was £100 off, so I got it for £199. That was the main attraction for me was the removable chin mount. Sorry chin part just so I can have my camera mount on it I'm waiting for my new hell mount proper mount what I'll fix across there so at the moment I've just got this temporary one off Amazon I've just got like a bit of M3 tape on it but it's it's not that strong so it was only a temporary one but I like that feature so what I would do now is I'm back on the bike Plug the USB in, so that's now power supply to the camera. There's my mic. Plug my mic in, and then that's my mic inside the helmet. So that's my new lead. The Nolan N70 2X with a removable chin guard mounted with my cable system for quick release. There we go, just a little vid. But that's my new, my new lid to cover my bonds. So I'm happy with it, I like it. It's got three vents here at the top you can open. You can remove the peak completely. So you can have it as a complete open face. I did ride Piggy's bike yesterday with the chin bounce off and the visor comes down that much. It's, it's, it don't fall off your chin. Someone's come to inspect the helmet. Oh mate. So see you later. Oof. 